block to close it out. Looked like you hit your head on the backboard. Yeah, I hit my head, I think, on the rim. It's hurting real bad. And I landed on my wrist, but I mean, you know, I saw him with the lane. I knew he was going for the for the layup, and I was just like, man, I'm finna go get this. Anthony Edwards is slowly becoming one of my favorite players in the NBA to watch on a nightly basis. And in this video, I want to break down why he is turning into one of the best players in the league, never mind just the Western Conference. We're going to break down some film, and we're going to see why Anthony Edwards is him. Okay, now the number one thing I love about Anthony Edwards is you cannot give this man a lick of space or he will make you pay. On this possession specifically, you see Mike Conley just kicking over to Anthony Edwards, but what do we notice? You see all this space here? Yeah, you gotta guard him 35 feet beyond the three-point line, right? So boom, just steps into a three, has the space and the ability to just shoot over anybody. In this case scenario, gets it to go from downtown and is starting to heat up once he starts to heat up it is almost impossible to guard this man now in my opinion if anthony edwards continues to play like this he will be in conversation for mvp listen to what charles barkley had to say about potentially ant winning mvp if Minnesota can hold on to the number one spot. Oh, he could be the MVP. He could be the MVP. I Over Joker. Yes. yes. No way. Yes. No way. Now, let me know in the comment section down below. Do you agree that Anthony Edwards should be in discussion for MVP over Shea and Jokic and Tatum? Let me know in the comments down below. But here we go. Let's watch another play. We're going to get a lot of motion here by the Timberwolves. This is another thing they love to do, which just makes the defense scramble. So, boom. We're going to have Mike Conley fake screen. Just going to drive around the perimeter of the lane or, or the, of the the three-point line and then we're going to get a fake screen here by uh, Rudy Gobert now what this does is put the team in a scramble right now you're seeing Anthony Edwards full steam ahead right to the basket now what Anthony Edwards does is draw a ton of attention now what do we notice at this point in time right we have three four guys here all eyes on Anthony Edwards right we have this backside corner wide open in TJ Warren a great pickup by the way I hope they you know sign him to a full length deal but here we go Edwards just kicks out to the corner wide open pretty much no closeout even you know there at all from the Pacers gets it to go the awareness the IQ of Anthony Edwards knowing if I drive I am going to be able to draw multiple different guys in on me and once I do that that's when we can start facilitating this ball and getting easy three-pointers to fall and this one was just the start of many now here we go another play I love by Anthony Edwards and another thing he does so well is finish around the basket no matter who is guarding him so boom we get a pick and roll we get a double team here off the screen with Miles Turner playing that drop zone coverage and then you have the guard fighting over the top so boom right away you think okay he's not gonna go up with this shot because he's going against one of the premier shot blockers of the NBA in Miles Turner but he does not care at all throws it up off the glass anyway gets it to go absolutely unbelievable shot made there by Anthony Edwards now in this possession we're going to get some isolation here between him and Andrew Nemar but we are going to see Rudy Gobert tail from the backside trying to give him a little bit of a screen now boom what we get right here is the switch now the Pacers switch everything which is you know one reason why their defense lacks this year is because they don't have guys who can switch everything and quite frankly on this play right here Miles Turner just doesn't step up doesn't contain the space and allows Anthony Edwards to just put up right over him right it's easy money every single time now before we get any further into the video do me a big favor and comment down below the number one if you think anthony edwards could win most improved player this season as well as maybe even mvp but actually do me another favor hit the like button let's get this video out to more timberwolves fans around the world and subscribe to the channel if you're new it is free doesn't cost anything and we will be covering the timberwolves non-stop for the rest of the season now let's get back into the video so boom fake screen we're gonna draw two defenders here with Halliburton and andrew Nemo and now the defense is in a little bit of a scramble so boom uh, Anthony Edwards just does a good job seeing that Tyrese Halliburton is not really pressuring up top but you know containing the baseline and we also have Jalen Smith here playing a little bit inside allowing you know them not to have him drive inside as well so boom what do we do if you're Anthony Edwards you can either kick this out to the corner or you can just say I'm the better guy I'm the better player and I can do whatever I want the coverage right there too much space don't leave that up for me Gets it to go. Unbelievable shot there by Anthony Edwards. And now they have a nice little two-point lead. He's starting to heat up, and it's really becoming 
you know, pretty much deadly for the Timberwolves right now. And keep in mind, no Carlton Towns. They're going to be up without him for a while. If they continue to play like this under Anthony Edwards, I'm telling you right now, he should win MVP. Another screen, some more drop zone coverage here by Jalen Smith. You're going to draw three defenders here into the lane. But again, what does he do? Go up with a tough shot. <clears throat> draw some contact and one sound dumb look at him going crazy man this is the hype you want to see and you know i remember reports coming out of college that he wasn't you know completely into basketball yeah i don't know if you ask me this dude seems like he is 100 down to becoming one of the greatest players of all time that's just what it seems like to me now here we go we're gonna get nasri top of the key they're gonna try to get a little play here for Anthony Edwards as he drives into the lane at the right time. Nasri throws up a layup, but you know the tenacity of Anthony Edwards to jump up, tip this ball up, up a couple of times, and gets it to go. I mean, the tenacity of Anthony Edwards is so, so amazing. With the NBA back in action, you guys need to go check out Underdog Fantasy. They're giving a special right now. It does expire at 3 p.m. Eastern Time right now, like in an hour. But with that being said, they give you so many freebies every single day. For, for this one, LeBron James under 131 points. Guys, how much of a give me is that, right? And you can pair it up with anything, any team, anywhere, anytime. There are so many pickums they have. I'm trying to see where the Boston Celtics are if they have them up right now. But guys, I'm telling you, they have so many different options of what you can bet on. We, we've seen almost every single team already. And here comes Jason Tatum, right? Over a double-double, six and a half first quarter points. I mean, the things that you can bet on are unbelievable, right? So many, so many. And there's so many more come out of Al Horford and Porzingis and whatnot. And you can pair it up with that, that LeBron James under 131 points. Easy money, right? Not only do they have NBA, they have FIFA, NHL, tennis, PGA, soccer, esports. Sports, NBA, basketball, golf. They have everything you can think of. Go sign up. Use my promo code, which is just Matty Dubs. Sign up. Use my promo code. They'll match your first deposit. And they're going to give you a free square as well. I'm going to go put something in here. Comment down below. What are you going to combine this under LeBron James with to win some easy money? And this is what you love to see out of a guy like Anthony Edwards. Don't be so you know, big ego that you just, when you don't get the shot, you just get back on deep. I mean, you, you, you do want to see that, but at the same time, when you have an open lane to the basket to get a putback attempt, you go every single time. Great layup and one should have been and one didn't get it to finish, but at the end of the day, this man, Anthony Edwards is insane. Now I want to, you know, go over a little bit to right here. So about a minute left in the game, 105, 105. Let's end this thing off. So Anthony Edwards, top of the key, going to get a little bit of a screen here from Rudy Gobert. We got some more drop zone coverage here by Miles Turner. But again, why are you playing drop zone coverage versus Anthony Edwards? Is able to just stop, pop, pull up a three. Nemard in his mouth, gets it to go. Easy money. It is, it's just too easy, right? So boom, here we go. 51 to play. Timberwolves up by eight. Bringing up the right side. He's saying clear out. Let me take this man one on one. We also need to see. We have a mismatch right here. Rudy Gobert and Andrew Nemard. As you know, Anthony Edwards drives into the lane, draws the two defenders, breaks Aaron Neesmith's ankles, pull up free throw line jumper. Again, you cannot give him any space space at all. Especially uh, you know, when you get a man to fall, it, it's completely over from there. But again, Pace is doing a really good job staying in this game. 110, 108, Edwards versus Pascal Siakam, a really lengthy defender here, drives right by him, fadeaway floater, up and good, unbelievable bucket there by Aaron ne or um by Anthony Edwards, gets the free throw line, and here we go, puts him up by two, 113-111 with seven to play. Now, what do we need? We need Anthony Edwards to come alive on the defensive side of the floor, and that is exactly what what he does let me zoom it back over a little bit Halliburton over to Aaron Neesmith a very solid finisher around the basket especially this season we see Anthony Edwards right here trailing maybe the third fourth guy back here drives all the way into the lane we've got a nice move by Aaron Neesmith and look at how high this man jumps man his head bounces off the backboard unbelievable block man this dude Anthony Edwards is one of the if not the best player in the NBA this season. And he's going to continue to show that each and every single day. The man is legendary.